Okay, hi, uh, I'm Jesse, and this is Brent. And Brent is um, Brian's cousin. So I'm Brian's cousin-in-law, and now Emily's cousin-in-law, I guess, as well. And if you had to think of a word to describe Emily, I would say that she's adorable. <laughs> totally sweet and natural, and I just think she's the cutest. So um, we're happy to be here, and we, we love them, and we're very, very excited for their future. So. I would say about Brian and Emily that they have a relationship that is charmed. Charmed. I think it's lovely. Just, I love seeing them together. I think that uh, Emily and Brian are both nice. They are nice people and they make a nice couple and it's great. Think about Emily and Brian as peas in a pod. <laughs> they are peas in a pod. That's my one word, okay? Okay. Because it's hyphenated. Yeah, it's hyphenated, okay? Uh -huh. and, and that's my one word. And, and the reason I say that is because what I know. They like all the same things, and then mostly I know that they love Booth Bay Harbor. And there's no peas in the pot in Booth Bay Harbor. There's lobsters, but maybe, maybe I should call them lobsters in a pot. Maybe, uh, lobsters in a pot instead of peas in a pot. Lobsters in a pot. That's even better. Yeah. They're yeah, like lobsters. twin lobsters. Twin lobsters. Twin lobsters. Twin lobsters. Twin lobsters. Like, you know, um, so many words to describe Brian. What's one good word? <laughs> oh, peace loving, music loving. Um, He's a lover, not a fighter. Lover, not a fighter. Yeah, but that's four words. Green. <laughs> that's five words, technically. Uh, I think should be a pass. That's okay. Um, <laughs> solid. Will you solid? All right, yeah, rock solid. solid yet? No, not solid. yet. Solid. That's my word. That's me. My word to you. Solid. Uh, I, describe Brian, I would say. Well, I would that might say be... passionate. He, okay. whatever he gets into, he is passionate about it. Whether it's Emily, music, Emily, his job, he's always been very passionate. And congratulations, Brian. He um, uh, cares about this earth and where it's going. Uh, very peace loving and drives uh, an SUV. And you know, <laughs> and, uh, a broken down SUV, or used to actually. He ditched it. Um, and congratulations. Right on. I think pure is a good word. Ooh, I wow. That was, that. yeah, wow. That was, yeah, that was a great one. Amazing. Something about their meeting and their love for each other. It feels like a first love, it's like it's pure. never been touched wow. before. Wow. Yes. I for agree. Brian Damn. And Sally. Yeah. Yes, that, that is the Perfect. word. Perfect. I'm going to say just flat out sexy. Oh! <laughs> We're hearing that pudding to Emily and Brian to me are soulmates. They are so happy with each other in each other's company. Whether they're riding their bikes or whatever they're doing, they're just each other's soulmates and best friends. I like it. Emily and Brian in your eyes, in your head. Yeah. I think we're going to go with blissful. Blissful. Because blissful's good. Yeah, and we're just grinning so Emily much. Uh, yes. Like, we know Martha had her the handkerchief. Yeah. It reminded me of our She was laughing. I laughed in my room. <laughs> she laughed. And that's the best way to so deal with it, right? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, we're on too much. I say that, that I wish them all the best, and I think they could be said. And the French expression is "au chaussure," like two old shoes together. Two old shoes together. Yeah, it means they're going to have fun, but then they're going to have nice, relaxed time. Perfect. Hi, I'm Steve Whalen. I'm a good friend of Brian's. Hopefully, he's a friend of mine. I think. He is. <laughs> um, Brian is, and Emily is, uh, are uh, very from the heart people. <laughs> Very artistic and very, you know, loving of life kind of folks. Um, all in all, it's a beautiful union, and I'm happy to be here. I'm Kathy. I'm Brian's mom. Mm -hmm. And the first time I met Emily a couple years ago. 
ago. Uh, we were coming to Jill, his sister's house, and they were out jogging. And when they came in, she was scrubbed face and perfectly natural, and I knew immediately this was someone that was going to fit well into our family. She, no pretense, and the one word to describe is perfect. He's, he's 38 in, in August, and it was worth the wait. Um, actually, yes, I am interviewing everybody. Are you guys ready? Go! Hi, Emily! And Brian! just truly perfect. It's a little cheesy, but everything has been perfect tonight. Perfecto. <laughs> <laughs> Happy go hippie. <laughs>